Experimental fiction is where the artist brings their independent, individual vision into their writing in a much stronger way than what we're accustomed to. In my experimental fiction classes, we get all sorts of people, and what really interests me is I get people that are first and foremost visual artists, first and foremost dancers, uh, first and foremost musicians, okay, but also want to work with text and want to integrate text into their practice. Really, for me, there's a lot of room for the individual to come along and say, I want to do it my way. The course is divided into four parts. The first part of the course, which we do for the first half an hour or so of each class uh, at the beginning, uh, is to study an experimental fiction technique from one of the great experimental writers like Joyce or Lydia Davis or Cathy Acker or Roberto Bellano, to think about it, to think about how that writer uses it. And then in the second half of the class, which is the second part and between classes, I set people up exercises where they attempt those techniques themselves. Course, so and as the time wears on, around four, week four or five, I start to talk to people very individually about what is their project, okay? What do they want to do? Uh, we had interactive computer fiction. We had audio work, work which was, you know, uh, for, for, for recording and for playback work and performance. We had short stories, okay, just using those techniques. Uh, and we had work which, which, we had a dance show, okay, which used text and dance as well. So, uh, and then the fourth part, uh, which is hugely important as well, and which is great fun more than anything, uh, is that we have a showcase reading, right? And we've managed to pack out our showcase reading so far uh, and have a really good time. So everybody gets a chance to present their work, whatever that might be. So my goal as a teacher is to be very, very individual uh, in my treatment of people and really to learn as much as I possibly can about the individual I'm dealing with and facilitate them. But then also facilitate people, uh, you know, to move forward as quickly as they can within the time period of the course. So very intense in terms of what I talk about. Uh, there's no sort of, you know, chit chat in the class. We're very, very serious. We work straight away. We look at the technique, we think about it, we talk about it, then we apply it and we individualize it. Okay, so we talk, think, apply, individualize.